First of all, I'm very happy to to have two points and we win uh, quite, I will not say easy, but uh, comfortable in the end, uh, 10 or 11 goals. And uh, that's uh, very, I have to say, strong after what's happened, in the, especially in the, in the last part of the first half that we, Camilla, have some uh, little bit bad injuries. And of course, that uh, affects some of our players. And, you know, uh, emotional was a little bit hard to, to switch and uh, make them come back on track. Uh, what, are your, what is your commentary about the, the injury of, of Camilla? Oh, at the moment I don't have any information about it. I just cross my fingers that uh, maybe it's not so tough that uh, it's look like, but uh, we will see tomorrow. Uh, I wait for the, my doctor to, to give, my, give me the update and we will see tomorrow. There was also uh, one foul for the red card against uh, Veronica Mala, so how is she feeling because she didn't play afterwards? No, uh, it's not. Uh, she will, uh, of course, if it was necessary, she will play. But uh, uh, we were leading by 10 goals, I think, and it was not necessary to force uh, uh, Adela. Uh, it's also a good wing player, so it's better for us to rest her uh, to be ready for the next game. There was also a lot of uh, fouls b by Congo players. So, uh, yeah. can you say anything about it? Did you maybe were you maybe surprised by the, the 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 thing that they were playing? Sometimes maybe a bit over the line. I think. Uh, no, it's a little bit more about our handball, and we are a little bit faster. And uh, of course, this is also something our young players need to learn. That uh, when when you play, you need to finish it 100%. And we did. And when you have so much speed and uh, you go into this uh, handball match, you, you will feel it. And of course, uh, you see, uh, we are much faster. That's why also some of this situation look a little bit ugly. But uh, it's not, uh, I, don't, I don't feel that Congo was any, I have to say, they, they were not dirty on the court. They, it was some just bad situations. It's not that they did it for purpose. I think it's, it was a good atmosphere on the, on the court, but uh, today, uh, you know, we, we, we need to learn that uh, even we need to be even tougher when we play these games, because uh, a situation like this can happen. And uh, one last thing, I don't know if you saw at least something of the first, uh, of the first match uh, between uh, the Netherlands and Argentina, uh, because Argentina is the next opponent, so the, what, does, what does it say, maybe the performance of, of our team, of the Czech team, for the, for the next game against uh, Argentina? Uh, I saw the first half, uh, and of course Argentina have qualities. Uh, they surprised me a little bit today, uh, because I haven't seen them play so well. Uh, of course, uh, Holland is a very, very strong team and in the end they, they cut the game. But uh, they also start to change players in the Argentina, so uh, sh for sure they were thinking also about our game. So uh, I think it will be, uh, I have to say, interesting days in front of this game because uh, we need uh, all uh, days to, to be prepared again. Because uh, this will be a little bit our final in this uh, group. Thank you so much. Bent, Bent, two last questions. Uh, what did you say to the girls uh, after first half? Because uh, there were uh, three penalties uh, in the end and, of course, the injury. So what did, yeah. what did you say? Uh, uh, first of all, I said we just need to stay calm and uh, don't be stressed uh, about it. Uh, we want to have some uh, fast uh, shooting and, uh, and we have good saves. So when we were three players we didn't lose uh, anything so for me it was just to to let this minute go and we have six uh, players back on the court so it's it's a little bit more mental things that uh, we are not uh, too much emotional inside so but i also said to my staff uh, a couple of these things it's uh, our uh, not mistakes, but we need to be sharper on the bench because when uh, it's so hectic, uh, it's only us can do something with it. So one of the penalties, it's our mistakes. So uh, I will uh, take that on my shoulders, but uh, the rest, it's a little bit, uh, I, I think it's uh, because of the motion about Camilla, especially and, and something, but uh, in the end, we, we manage it. So I'm proud of the girls. Four players uh, played their first game uh, at the World Championship. So, yeah. so you see, you know, they were uh, nerves far out of the jersey. 
they were talking about this game and Congo like they were the world championship uh, play uh, winner last time, you know, and I said, no, <laughs> please, we just need to play our handball and uh, we will manage to win this game. But, you know, uh, young players, they need to learn this. And of course, if you don't have this uh, emotion when you play uh, the world championship, uh, then uh, you are not here, you know, so it means a lot for our uh, <laughs> young girls to, to play. So, yeah, I think it's a learning. Thank you very much.